I just hear a crunch. I didn't see anything. And next thing I know, my bike is by the guardrail. And I'm 50 feet the other way across the street. About four o'clock in the afternoon, I was burning the brush. And I remember I was sitting there watching the fire, stood up and had some sort of a, I don't know, blood sugar thing or whatnot. They really haven't figured out why, but I fell right into the fire. Ambulance came. I don't remember a whole lot. I had every one of my ribs were fractured, but three. Both of my lungs were punctured and I had a, a two vertebrae in my back were fractured. Went by ambulance to uh, UofL Hospital. I had, you know, severely burned right arm, um, had tendons in my hand, uh, burned in half. I was in the ICU for 33 days, I believe. Total time out of home in the hospital is 107 days. I was in for two months, was right above the, the helicopter pad. <laughs> and every day there were helicopters coming in there from all over the state. Mm -hmm. And uh, I thought, you know, you know, thank God, thank God for uh, this resource. Six floor burn unit is just chock full of saints. The, the care and the compassion that I was shown really, really got me through. Each injury and each patient are different, so our approaches need to be as well. They both said really kind things about the staff and the hospital here, and that makes me so happy and proud to be able to work here and just have an impact on people's lives like that. It's a unique situation to be in. I'm Jenny and I am a specialty social worker here specifically for the Trauma Institute. So we will bring in our trauma survivors from a few years back and they will go through a training and they will be able to come in and support new patients. But sometimes it's just really helpful to have a person that has been there, walked in your shoes, might not be exact the same injury, but they're feeling a lot of the same emotion. If you work at it, you work hard, you can get back to a great way of life. I can't stress enough how lucky we are fortunate in this area to have such a resource as as U of L Health. They're lifesavers. Um, they put me back together. <laughs>